Known throughout the world as one of the most prestigious academic awards, the Rhodes Scholarship is an international post-academic award of study at the University of Oxford. The award is named after Cecil Rhodes, an English-born turned South African politician. At the time of his death, he was one of the wealthiest men in the world. In his name, the award was set up for outstanding scholars to study any full-time postgraduate course offered by the university, whether a taught master's program, a research degree, or a second undergraduate. Today, the scholarships are administered and awarded by the Rhodes Trust, which was established in 1902. There are four standards by which all applicants are judged. Literary and scholastic attainments, energy to use one's talents to the full as exemplified by fondness for the success in sports, truth, courage, devotion to duty, sympathy for the protection of the weak, kindliness, unselfishness, and fellowship, and moral force of character and instincts to lead, and to take an interest into one's fellow beings. As of date, there have been many famous individuals who were Rhodes Scholars. Among them is former U.S. President Bill Clinton, former England Prime Minister Tony Blair, and the current Louisiana Governor Bobby Jindal. On a more unique note, Myron Roll, a former Florida State University All-American football player, was recently given the award. His interview for the scholarship was originally scheduled at the same time as Florida State was to play at Maryland, but the NCAA decided to allow Roll to take a chartered plane from his interview in Birmingham, Alabama to College Park. He was awarded the scholarship less than three hours before the game. He is currently studying at St. Edmunds College at Oxford University. For more than a century, Rhodes Scholars have left Oxford with virtually any job available to them. For much of this time, they have overwhelmingly chosen paths in scholarship, teaching, writing, medicine, scientific research, law, the military, and public service. They have reached the highest levels in virtually every field.